<laughs> Hello, beautiful people. Mm, 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 mm. Beautiful people. <laughs> Hello, guys. Welcome back to my channel. This is Fearlessly Living with Doc Martin, and I'm she. Monday it is new video Monday and I'm so excited to be doing this video because this time around I am putting you all up in my business inviting you into all of my stuff okay I am showing you <coughs> what is in my work bag so do you guys remember I did a it was not dirty I did a video on my work bag new bag new job i'm gonna link it okay um so this is the bag 20 out of 10 recommend this bag is big like it fits a lot of stuff um it's sturdy i am really concerned about like the the handles but i think it's i think it's in there i think it's in there so yeah that's the only thing i'm concerned because i'm planning on using this bag for a long time I may have to like uh, replace the handle or, or do something else with the handle in the long run. Maybe get ones that are a little thicker and wider. But so far so good. I have been really careful with especially holding on my shoulder with so much stuff. Um, but yeah, this is my bag. My work bag. Home I love so much. That's where I said home. I love so much. So, uh, let's get into it. Let's get into what is in the bag of a first year internal medicine resident. Intern slash resident. Because if you watched my previous video, you know that I am both an intern and a resident. <laughs> anyway, that's no here or there. Let's get into the video. So, first things first, first thing first, I'm a killer. Uh, first things first computer computer so I have my this is 13 inch MacBook Air rose gold color um I got this like two two years ago two or two years ago two or three years ago anyway um this is my trusty psychic um I don't rarely do I leave home without it even though there are a lot of computers at the hospital lots of computers that I could use um I always just kind of have this if I want to study or type something I just like to have my computer with me really that's just what it is there's no excuse that's it I always have my computer always my computer um next thing <clears throat> I'm studying for step three trusty first aid USMLE step three the final of the three steps thank you very much um so this is in there I also have um there's another book I think it's child I don't remember the name of the book I have some other step three studying material is what I'm trying to say so I have this in there I carry this with me all the time because any little bit of free time I get I'm opening up the book and I'm using my computer and you world is coming up that's just what it is um, <laughs> poor Joe malfunction. I got a cue for y'all today. Mm, do you like my dress? Do you like my dress? If you like my dress, I might link it in the description so you could buy one for yourself. <laughs> okay, so USMLE. Another thing is, so I have this notebook. In this notebook, I've been writing like every day. Um, things that I'm hmm, how do I say this for example something that I have in this book is just like uh, 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 cancer screening at different ages internal medicine we're dealing with really anybody from 18 up until they meet the Lord um, so really just like cancer screening what age what what age group gender when to start that's like so it's just like things that I kind of use every day I write in here um Illnesses that I see every day, so I'm continuously adding to this book. Illnesses that I see every day, chest pain, AKI, DKA, 
CHF, you know, just like the other day because I'm on neurology, I have put stroke workup and stroke management here. So like I have this with me. It's not in my lab coat. It could fit, but I have it with me so I can always just like refer to it like, okay, so I have this stroke person. I need to be doing this, 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 and this. And then just kind of going through and like, okay, cool. I got everything down. So this is my trusty book. This is, this is what this book is. Um, also, if you saw my video on organization, this is my planner. Um, we're, I'm almost done with it. I'm waiting to buy a new one so I could switch it to this because this is way too big. So I need to, I just have like a book in here, but I need to get a planner that fits in here. Um, so yeah, this is my planner. Um, I walk around with it because I might need to schedule something. I have been having the hardest time scheduling doctor's appointments for myself, which is really crazy to me. But that's how it really happens. Doctors don't have time to see doctors. So this is my planner. <laughs> that's my little spill. And then I have this. I see in color. My life is very colorful and bright. Even though black is my favorite color. <laughs> and I've been wearing a lot of black. But this is how I study. Um, this is how my planner looks. I love these color pens. I'll link them below again. Um, of course I have regular pens but I love these because I use it in my planner and I use it to study so I always have this with me um, another thing is this was given to us by our program I just keep my chargers and stuff in here I used to own an airpod pro I no longer know where that is it used to be in this bag so just computer phone charger um, I have in here just to kind of keep everything organized um, another thing is my toiletry kit. Uh, I guess if y'all want to know it's my toiletry kit, I'm, I can tell y'all. So, toiletry kit, in my toiletry kit, lotion. I took this from the hospital. Sorry, from my hotel. <laughs> I love hotel lotions. Some of them smell really good, and they're really tiny, and they're great for toiletry kits. So, I got this from the Lang Hand in Chicago. And then I have uh, hand wipes in here. Lip gloss. Fenty, of course. Who else does I have lip gloss? I have Miss Dior. Psst, psst. You gotta smell good. Like, you can't be going to people's rooms smelling bad. Like, you gotta smell good. Um, aspirin. Trust me, you need this more than you know. The other day, I noticed that somebody bought like a bunch of like medication. Like, I think it was like aspirin and Tylenol, and they put it in the lounge. And I was like, this person is thinking. But yeah, I have my own. Um, and then I also have this only because my boyfriend buys these in like bulk. Like, he literally wants one to be in every ounce of the apartment. Like, so I took one of these and put them in my... I don't really like using it because it's like I have to use my fingers, which is why I don't like this. Um, I have like a little, you know, tube thing in my lab coat pocket that I use. So I don't really use this that much. I don't like using my fingers to my face when I'm at the hospital, especially at the hospital. You feel me? So that's that. I have eczema really only on my lips in well not really winter months it's doing when the seasons change when I'm stressed it's just sporadic so I have this in here just in case I need to knock it out real quick alright um I have that I have a mirror a little compact mirror. Pop, pop. Pop, pop. Everyone needs a mirror. So I have this in here. Um, of course, I have my feminine products. Okay. We all know what this is. I have that. I have a little Kleenex. More feminine products. <laughs> I think every time, every month I put like two or three in here. So they've been piling up. Um, 
Hand sanitizer also given to us by the hospital. It's like a little squirt. I have that in here. Um, I've wear, I've been wearing my I wear, I put this wig on for this video, but I wear my hair short. I've been wearing my hair short for the past couple of weeks, but I have scrunchies in here for my. Sometimes I have to just quickly snatch up a ponytail because I don't want to be leaning over a patient with my hair all over the place. So I have these, and then I have. Mascara, quick mascara. Um, it's a little sample, a little tiny one from Chanel. Um, and then I have some like uh, things like Nyquil, Dayquil stuff, but like generic, cause I was getting sick at some point. Like I don't know what was happening. But yeah, I have that. That's um. That's all I have. So that is what's in my toiletry kit. Put that back. I should do what's in my locker. I'm gonna do a video of what's in my locker at work. That's a good video to do. Oh, uh, what else? So the bag itself is empty now. This is my business phone for Blue Day. Shop Blue Day. I don't really use this phone that much to be honest. I'm thinking like, should I just get rid of it? But then I do sometimes use it. Um, in this pocket I have hematology flashcards, which I no longer need to be carrying with me. I'll put that away. I have a pen, sticky notes, flashcards, more sticky notes. Alcohol wipe, of course. Um, I also have highlighter. So that's in there. Put this back. One pocket. The other pocket is really where I keep my wallet. So these, in here is my business cards for like my business itself. So pencil highlighter. I'm just going to put it in this other pocket. <laughs> you know, this video is helping me organize my bag. Thank you. So, um, little day business cards like, oh, I love this. Ready? Boom! Here's my card. Um, and then my wallets. Yeah, I have two wallets. Um, and then on the outside pocket, I don't know if you remember when I did a review of this bag, but it's like you saw how much stuff I took out, and I still got like three other pockets, and they're deep. Like this bag. 20 over 10. Recommend. I'm telling you. Um, I have like this is like a mask. Oh, I never know if I'm pronouncing that right to be honest. The mask um, holder. So I have like an extra pair of mask in here. So it's like a. I got this from a hotel too. I think it was. There's a tree. One of these hotels have a tree. I can't remember. But I love that they had that, like a little case. And then my vitamins. So, like, a lot of times when I take them in the morning before I go to work, before I've eaten anything, it makes me really nauseous and it makes me feel weird until I eat. So I just put them in my bag instead. Refill them every beginning of every week. And then um, once I eat breakfast or lunch, then I take them. So that's why they're in here. Um, yeah. Time to put my stuff back in my bag. I actually just had to buy um, this case the other day because I was just sliding my computer in here and I was realizing that it was getting scratched up really bad. And I think it's like by this. So I just bought this case. I'm not a huge. This side was really good, but I hate that this, this doesn't match this side. So that made me mad. But yeah. I'm just going to put this stuff back in here real quick. <laughs> That's how I organize it. Just kind of like slide everything in there. 
good to go. So, uh, oh. there's so much space, like, it's crazy. I could still add, like, another book. Sometimes I have, I take my other book with me, too. But, um, yeah, so that was what's in my book bag as a um, first year internal, med internal medicine resident. Uh, once again, as always, I love to see you guys every Monday. This has been a pleasure. I have been trying my best to record videos ahead of time and just be consistent. And I've been so far, woo -woo, you know, pat on the back. Y'all gotta, you know, I've been doing good. So, I'm happy about that. Again, like, thank you for coming to my channel. Seriously, like, I cannot stress that enough. I appreciate this so much because you don't have to be here. But you take time out of your day to come and chat with me or just listen to me ramble on about God knows what. And I appreciate that. Let's keep that up. Let's keep doing that. But let's do that on Instagram as well. And on TikTok. Okay? So follow me on Instagram and TikTok. And if you're not subscribed to this channel, please hit that subscribe and notification button so that you know whenever I post a new video. Okay? And it's usually every Monday at noon. Thank you so, so much for coming to my channel and watching this video. I will see you next Monday. Bye!